The third biennial applied research conference of the technical universities in Ghana in Sunyai has relevant researchers from academia and industry across Ghana and beyond. The conference under the auspices of the vice chancellors has a technological exhibition of daily problem solving projects from all 10 technical universities in Ghana. The chairperson of the vice chancellors of TUG, Professor Elias Soli, said they could deliver more on their mandate with more infrastructural support. We are grateful to the government for equipping the technical universities with the state of the art machines and other equipment, but we will appreciate if more resources are committed to support infrastructure development to enable technical universities to deliver on their mandates. This will reduce unemployment among the youth since the graduates from our universities are equipped with employable skills. We hope that the conference will offer the opportunity for some bonding between academia and industry and of course uh, government so that together we see how we can move this country forward. For if we fail to develop the middle level manpower through TVET, uh, it will take us much longer to get where we want to go. The president, Nane Kufuado, in his address said if effective university, industry and government partnerships are to be realized, it would be necessary to have more encounters between industrialists and universities to ensure a better understanding of stakeholder functions. He assured of government investment in research and development to maximize the university's benefit. Government will conscientiously and progressively revamp and increase its investment in research and development in order for the nation to derive maximum benefits from them. The theme of this conference underscores the importance of partnership in driving national development. By working together, universities, industry and government can create a powerful synergy that accelerates innovation and entrepreneurship, leading to economic growth, job creation and improved quality of life for all Ghanaians. Let us commit to strengthening these partnerships, leveraging our collective expertise, and thus advancing Ghana's development. The president also underscored the need to boost STEM education to equip the youth to leverage digital opportunities. In today's digital age, technology is a key driver of innovation and entrepreneurship. The rapid advancements in fields such as artificial intelligence, biotechnology, and renewable energy present unprecedented opportunities for economic growth and societal progress. However, to leverage fully these opportunities, we should ensure that our workforce is equipped with the necessary skills and knowledge. This requires a concerted effort to entrench STEM education at all levels. Government through the Ministry of Education has invested heavily in the development of high quality STEM institutions and programs, providing training and resources for teachers and encouraging greater participation of our youth and girls in these fields. The conference, which will climax with an awards night, is themed University, Industry and Government Partnership for Accelerating Innovation and Entrepreneurship for National Development. Precious Semevo, Joy News, Sunyai.